the last morning looking down at Main Street and the castle. So sad that it's our last day, but we've got a good day planned. Only um, Tomorrowland and Fantasyland are open during the early morning hours at Magic Kingdom, which we didn't realize. So we're going to head over to maybe do Space Ranger Spim because we didn't end up doing that the other day. Listen up. Green Squadron will retreat the power cells while the rest of you concentrate on those robots. So it seems that Space Ranger Spin is just the ride that is never meant to be. We got in line and then something happened and we were waiting around for a bit so we decided to duck out of that line. We're now heading over to Space Mountain to see what that line is like so hopefully we can ride that. Ready to go on Haunted Mansion again? Yep. Sure. So, so far the only thing we've managed to do this morning is the Jungle Cruise. Things haven't gone to plan no, this morning, have they? No, they haven't. Um, we were going to go on Space Mountain, but then decided to wait around near um, the Fantasyland um, Liberty Square area for that to open up so we could go over to um, Big Thunder Mountain. However, everybody headed there yeah, and it's been like we were just like herded like cattle yeah and there was just, it was just a bit crazy and then there was a huge line to get yeah. into the line to go on to big um, thunder mountain so we scrapped that idea so we're now heading around to go and do the haunted mansion this will probably be our last ride on the haunted mansion this trip We've gotten this photo every trip with his hat from Animal Kingdom. So I've gone for the chicken and waffle from Sleepy Hollow. I've been wanting to try this for a while. It looks enormous and very, very tasty. Chicken waffle was really, really good. It was quite greasy though. That's the only thing I would say. We're now heading into the Emporium. I'm going to look through here on our way out before we then head back to the resort. I'm going to just have a bit of a relaxation before we then head out to Epcot. We're back at the resort and we thought we'd just sit here for a moment and enjoy the seats just underneath the tower there. They're really comfy. And we've both got a refill in our mugs. We're just trying to make the most of the resort before we have to leave tomorrow. Mm, we don't want to go home. So we finished up at the hotel. We had a bit of a rest. We went to the pool, showered, and now we're heading back out again to go to Epcot. It's a little bit rainy. It started to rain literally just as we left the pool. Um, so we thought that would be our time to go and freshen up ready for Epcot. So we're going to go and head out, have our last evening in the parks and also watch Harmonious. And also we do have a lightning lane for our favorite ride, Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind. This time entering a park this trip, so sad. Stuck on our tour in Epcot. We're going to go to Creations because I want to get a new spirit jersey. I haven't really seen many actually since we've been here, but James spotted one in Creations that he thought I'd really like. So we're going to go and have a look at that and maybe make a purchase or two. We'll see. They've got the pretzel one and the Mickey bar. That's all of the food and wine stuff over here. So this is the one that James said about, it's black and sparkly and then on the back they have got the Spaceship Earth with lots of different colours and Harmonious in different languages and then on the back there it says Harmonious and Epcot. So I'm going to think about that spirit jersey but for now I'm going to get those yucca fries and maybe the fry flight, I haven't quite decided yet, but definitely those yucca fries because they are delicious. Here are the yucca fries or the yucca fries they smell so garlicky and delicious and they look just as crisp as last time as good as you remember mm. better so good. they're just so um like garlicky aren't they like really garlicky really herby and crispy mm. they're just perfect so so good 
better than Nomad Lounge and also cheaper than that small plate that we had. Just got in line for test track. First time at this trip. James isn't such a fan of this ride. He prefers it before it was like remodeled with Chevrolet. To go through to the design studio and see what type of car we're going to design. It looks quite nice though. Yeah. Those, they look silly. Yeah, they do look really ridiculous. Get ready to test our design. Do you think we'll win? Probably Let's hope on, so. Probably on power. Maybe. We're not going to win anything on efficiency. No, we're not going to win anything on efficiency. Ready? I'm excited. We'll see. I bet you'll love it. Probably. for a test track we were in the right place at the right time after getting our yucca fries because they literally just opened up as we were finishing them so i managed to get on really quickly and considering that ride has had one of the longest if not the longest wait time in um at quite point was we were really really lucky to get in when we did so that was good i'm going to get the bummy bow this one here yeah, looks pretty good the bow is pretty small, like it's a really small bow, but I think it's going to be a lot tastier than the one I got from the Chinese pavilion. The bow bun really packs a punch, it's got a really nice spiciness to it and some really nice fresh flavours from the topping. So I think that one is nicer than the one from the China pavilion. So if you're going to get one, I would get the one from the Flavours of Fire. The Shimmering Sips Guava Mousse, which is a vegan dessert. You've been wanting this one for pretty much the entire trip, haven't you? Yeah, I have, yeah. So finally got to try it on the last day. Yeah, not got around to having it. No. Until now. It's got like a biscuit base yeah. at the bottom, which would be quite nice. Doesn't look very um, pretty once you cut it, does it? Uh -huh. Like, no, yeah. No, it does not. It's interesting flavours, but it's really quite nice. I like the, the crunchy base. Mm-hmm. Mm really makes it well I know it's a moose but if it was just a moose yeah it wouldn't, it wouldn't be, be as interesting it. no be like that crunchy yeah. texture mm -hmm. adds a bit of something extra to it mm. we're now heading around for our last ride of this trip we're going over to Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind sad it is the last ride of the holiday but excited that it is this ride that we're ending it on because it is a really really good one and I'm really pleased that we bought the lightning lanes for this. So in total it cost $37 to get the lightning lanes for this ride for this evening. A little bit of an update, the ride is currently down. So we can ride at, at any point this evening. However, we wanted to watch Harmonious. It is now half past seven. So hopefully it will come back on before Harmonious. Otherwise, we'll have to try and get a refund on the Lightning Lane because it's quite pricey. You know, $37 um, for two people to ride in the Lightning Lane is a lot of money when you've spent a lot in Disney World already. So we made the decision not to wait around the Guardians area and we've come into the land and we're going to ride on Sorin and potentially living with the land before we then head out to go and watch the fire. So we managed to get onto Guardians of the Galaxy. I'm really, really happy about that one. And we've got four minutes until Harmonious. So we'll be able to fit in both things that we wanted to do this evening, which is the perfect way to end the trip. Last glimpse of Spaceship Earth before we head out, James. How do you feel? Hi. <laughs> Today is our very last day here and we are about to check out. We have packed everything away and we're both feeling very, very depressed that we are now going to be going home. Um, but before we leave, we have got some time at Disney Springs. So at least that kind of softens the blow a little bit. We've packed everything. We're going to go and check everything into Bell Services and then we're going to head over to Disney Springs to spend a few hours there. Goodbye room. You've been good to us. 
the beds are so comfortable. Yeah, the beds have been very, very comfortable. Um, and yeah, just a really nice room, really spacious. Bye room, I'm going to miss you. I'm going to miss these beds. Thank you. It smells so good. That is a smell. Yeah. It's so chocolatey. Look at this guy. <laughs> That's the coffee cake one that I was going to get. Yeah. That's the original. Look at the original of all of those chocolate chips. Um, that one and then the pistachio toffee. Indians, you can see it in the background there. We've got a cold brew each. I've gone for the chocolate orange or the chocolate mocha and James has got the peanut butter crunch one. Both of these are vegan, although they don't do vegan cookies, they do do vegan drinks and they come as a vegan. So we're going to try these. There we go, so we're going to try them. They said to kind of give them a bit of a stir. They are oat based. So we're going to give it a try. Chocolate orange or the um, chocolate mocha. It's very nice. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that hit of orange is mm -hmm. really nice, really nice, isn't it? Yeah. Very good. Mm -hmm. I also bought two cookies. However, I'm saving those for later. So I'm not going to eat those now. I'm going to take them home with us. Safe. Space for pizza. Yeah, I'm gonna save the space for a pizza. We're going to go to Blaze and I'm going to yeah have those cookies when we get home because I think it'll be a nice snack to have to kind of beat the holiday blues maybe. Oh, this is so good. I really like this um, artwork at Disney Springs and it's completely made out of Lego just outside of the Lego store. I also like how it's got all of the different Disneylands on here. I just think it's really cute. Now heading into World of Disney. When we were here the other day, it was really busy. So hopefully it'll be a lot quieter and we can just have a more sort of chilled look around. It was so hectic in here before. So hopefully this time it'll be a much better visit. They also have the Mickey Mouse shaped um, hand pumps, which are a Halloween design. They're $19.99. I'd like something like this, but a Christmas version. Here's the spirit jersey. I quite like the design of this actually. That's really fun with Walt Disney World on there and then it's got a um, tie-dye bottom to it and the front has got the Walt Disney World logo and also Mickey Mouse. Blaze having a last meal, James has got the high rise again with that vegan cheese. I've got the vegan cheese on mine as well but I've also got some chicken and I've got the original crust which is a thinner crust. It looks so, so tasty. We finished up at Blaze. It was delicious. Best pizza. We're heading to our seats, unfortunately. We're back home. Well, at the airport. Now heading to arrivals for baggage reclaim. We made it back to the car. The luggage took forever to get. We're just happy to be back in the car. And James remembered that we'd left ourselves a drink each in here as well. 